Right, hopefully this is the last take. This is the Steam Link, that's the screen. That's the make file that has all the modifications necessary to port Small Life to the, uh, whatever it is, Steam Link through the Steam SDK or whatever, Steam Link 1. So, uh, I'm gonna sit down. This is it. It crashes a whole bunch. It's not the Steam Link, it's my crappy coding, as usual. But here it is, it's loading, and uh, I can play it if I can find the mouse. All right, here we go. I'm gonna play it, it loads. Doesn't have any music. It's probably a uh, memory thing. So it's too big or whatever. Yeah, it loads in, and uh, after loading, it runs pretty okay, you know, considering this is basically Raspberry Pi hardware. It's like even less RAM. But yeah, the only thing that seems to lag is the uh, calling view that shows the tiles and objects being cold. So, I can move over here, mess with the physics objects, kind of fly into the cave real quick. This scene has a <laughs> 1 in 5 chance of crashing, and this has plagued me all the time. Alright, so if he drinks the bottle, then uh, it's going to be safe, but if he doesn't, then it's probably going to crash. Alright, we're good. Gonna play the little cutscene that's gonna fade out to black. So, uh, this is this part. And I'm gonna. Alright, and it locks the player. There we go. I'm gonna go to this one. This is the uh, next scene and the last one because uh, I didn't finish this game. But, uh, so it's over here. And I'm gonna break through the physics of this game because it's super easy. And then you need both, so got the key in that. I'm gonna scoot over here. Now the uh, game is completed. So uh, yeah, that's it. This is the uh, thing running on the Steam Link. All right, bye.